even a mature program that's been around for 20 years uh, that you know, has had success over three generations of cars, always looking for the next thing to make you competitive, to make you safer, to um, give you that advantage when you get to the track. Well, I think the one thing that stands out the most recently is the brake changes that the guys have come up with. You know, it's a big challenge to the crew to say you have 35 seconds from the time the car stops to have the wheels back on with a new set of heads and rotors and calibers and uh, it could be off and going again. Uh, before that was the, was the radar system that the guys came up with and uh, working with Bosch. Uh, now everybody has it, but uh, for a little while there we had that for ourselves and that was, that was uh, a good advantage knowing what was going on. A bit similar with the uh, AC system actually, we were the first to introduce that. When everybody else was suffering like crazy, we came out of the car pretty well and hardly sweaty. One thing to sort of point out is the, uh, it's the crash box in the door. that absorbs a lot of energy in case of a, a side impact of somebody hitting straight in the door. It, is, it becomes increasingly difficult as the car becomes more mature, longer term homologation periods now where there's less things you can change, but it just opens up your eyes to look at different places on the car that you, you need to find performance and how do you do that.